This is how early morning looks like. Si Jay toka wapema hivi. Hey guys, hope you've been keeping on well, hope you are fine. I'm back to Nanyuki. Today I think I won't be showing so much of the town. Anyway, nimeingia na Moshene hata sijawaambia karibuni. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, karibu sana. Uh, for the guys who've been here, nawapenda tu sana. Thank you for supporting me. Thank you for keeping it uh, here and uh, enjoying my vlogs and watching my vlogs. So, I'm back in Nanyuki. I don't know if last time I showed this place. Uh, my camera is not that good. Let me clear it. Yeah, so I'm back to Nanyuki. I had gone to some other offices down there. The one, if you haven't, if you have not watched my previous video on uh, Nanyuki, go and watch it. The offices are down there. It's in this place, this place that's looking like this. I want to show you something, guys. I don't know if you have seen it when I was just going around like this, but I want to show you something beautiful something amazing today i've been able to capture it so well here where is it where is it where is my finger here you see i'll flip the camera and show you this is mount kenya guys this is mount kenya wow it's so beautiful wow i've never gone to see it there i've never gotten to see it like this oh my god it's so beautiful i like it it's so close like i can literally like see you, you guys cannot see it clearly because it's the phone and the distance and whatever but when i fl flip the camera you'll see it oh my god i've never seen those i feel like i can go like through this and then climb on it but it's a bit far but to the eyes it's so close it's so close let me flip the camera and show you guys oh my god here it is guys oh no it's so beautiful uh -oh, my camera so here we are here it is oh man it's so beautiful the camera is not doing just oh my god you guys uh, i feel like literally i can walk through this path and then I'll be there on top of the mountain. I can't even see the snow. It's only that there is like this, this thing here like, oh my God, focus, uh, like looks like, uh, like mist. So you guys can't see nicely, but for me, oh, I'm enjoying the view. I'm enjoying, I'm super excited. Oh my God, you don't know what I'm feeling. I've never seen it so this close. I always see it. When I'm driving to from, uh, not when I'm driving. Oh, thanks God. Manifestation. I'll be driving soon. Uh, when I'm going to Nyeri or you're coming to other parts, you'll see just the tip of it. Right now, I can see even the the slopes, like the 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 bottom, the bottom part. Oh my, it's magnificent. It's amazing. It's beautiful. I can't stop saying this. I think I'll say that until you guys get bored. I feel like I want to go and climb Mount Kenya right now. Uh. Guys, I don't know how I got to miss this last time. I know because I was late when I was going to that other meeting. I got so late. Uh, yeah, from the town, from Nanyuki town to this cup place, it's called... I think Mozaiga or Kirimani or something because on this side I am it's a uh, it's a uh, what I don't know how to explain the other side of the road okay I'm on this side then there's a road here then I'll go there the other side of the road kuna an estate called Boda 
there's a nested called uh, Kilimani or Milimani. It's so beautiful that nested. So I'm um, on this side of the road. Like from town, I can't explain you guys. I don't know Nanyuki so much. So, but from that coming road, you go on the left. That's where I am. And uh, it's just huge parcels of land. I don't know if they have owners or they are just government lands. I don't know. But I would want to wake up to this view every other morning. It's refreshing. Wow. I just love it. I just love it. See? I don't know. You guys can see. These things are blogging it. Wow. I'm in a surprise. Like, it's so nice. Oh my god. I can still believe I can see Mount Kenya from me. You know, some people to them, it's a big, it's not a big deal because you live here or you see it every other day. But for me, this is a big deal. Oh. It's a big deal. Oh, yeah. Because go to Atuna Milima. This is the highest mountain in Kenya. So, seeing it this close, it's a big deal. It's a big deal. Huh? You understand me? Understand the excitement? Understand the hype? It's a big deal. Yeah. These trees, they are good. They are beautiful being there. But they are not doing just to the mountain. They are blocking it. Oh, this place is so serene. It's so quiet. Ah, I would want to have a retirement home here. Or a vacation home. Yeah. To be coming here once in a while. Yeah. It's not cold, but I hear that sometimes in the morning. It gets very, 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 very cold. Yeah. But right now, it's okay. It's about 10 a.m. in the morning. So, you can imagine. I left Nairobi early in the morning. I left Nairobi at 6 a.m. And it's 10 a.m. Today, I didn't want to uh, mess up and get late again. So, yeah. Let's enjoy Nanyuki for the second time. This is the main road I was talking about. So, on my left, that's where the estate, the beautiful estate he is. And then, this is where I am from. From this side, you can see the mountain. Unfortunately, the trees are blocking it. So I'm having my snack. Ah, ah this is the Boda Boda. There's, there are no like matatus. I don't know if there are matatus that fry around this route. So as of now, the Boda Bodas, it's the one that I use from coming to this place from the main town to this place I used a, a Buddha Buddha so that's why the guy is asking if I'm going to use a Buddha Buddha so, so I'm just going to take a walk uh, as I enjoy my snack because I left home quite early in the morning uh, then when I'm done maybe I can take a, a Buddha by then but as of now let me enjoy this short walk although i am missing my mountain back there the view i wish the view was on this side so that i can watch it but my god i'm telling you guys it was just this close like you know this close like i could literally climb on it though it's <laughs> i know i can't like walk there and just climb but it looks it looked so close like i could literally touch it so, yeah, I don't know. I'm just super excited. That has made my day. Eh? Yeah. I don't want to take that guy. So, you see that building behind me? It's written 1951. So, it seems it was built in 1951. And it looks so nice and beautiful. Nanyuki is a vibe, guys. Nanyuki is a vibe. Ah, last time I was so stressed up because I couldn't get here on time. I almost missed the meeting right now, but today I'm quite relaxed. So that's why I am enjoying this day. I'm quite relaxed today. Then here there's a 
Baptist Church. So if you know this church, even it's written Mount Kenya. Let me show you. If you are from Nanyuki and you know this church, so you can tell what I'm talking about. You know, or you know this road, what it's called. Sa Sa there is the church. It's called Mount Kenya Baptist Church. As you guys can tell, there are not a lot of matatus around. The only thing you can see is Boda Boda. So, yeah, this is the Baptist Church. And it looks quite old. It looks quite old. There are beautiful houses here. Like, it looks ancient. Maybe it was built so many years ago. But it looks nice and beautiful. That's my shadow. It's quite dry, though. That's the only disadvantage of living on the slopes of Mount Kenya because you get to experience this dry climate or dry weather. Uh, I think, if I remember very well from my geographic class, yeah, so it's so dry. That's the only disadvantage of this place. But otherwise, it's a vibe. They have so many hotels, different hotels. There are so many tourists that come here. Uh, we have the British Army that have a... I don't know whether they call it a practicing site or whatever. Whatever, whatever the Army do in their field to train. Training grounds, I think. So there are so many British people around. Or white people around this place. That's why it's such a vibe. It's so vibrant because with foreigners, you need to put up good hotels. You need to have a vibrant business, thriving business economy. So many things. Um, the last time I was here, uh, I was here in December 23rd. You can, eh, was it 23rd or 24th? I think 23rd, that's why it was so hectic, you can imagine. Uh, it's the last day to Christmas Eve, and uh, it's, it was on a Friday, so many things happening. But today, today is on the 3rd of February. Oh guys, yesterday was my birthday. Yesterday was my birthday, I enjoyed it, I had fun. Not that much fun, because I was working literally the whole day the whole 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 day i didn't have much to do like for my birthday but maybe i'll celebrate it on sunday yeah with my friends my and my sisters and yeah so that's kind of a thing so yeah i was talking about i was here the last time i was here was in the december 23rd but today's that uh february to that and that okay yeah at least today i'm chilled out i can walk take a breath take a, a walk and enjoy this place oh, wind it's windy this is the route it's, i know you can't see the reading but it may go ck saint george's parish see behind me there's this hotel the rustic, the rustic hotel. It looks nice. There behind me, it looks quite good. Uh, you can Google it. The rustic, R U S T Q U E, something like that. Yeah, it looks nice. So, have I gone inside to tell whether it's nice? As it looks from the outside, you can just Google it. Maybe they're on Google. So behind me is the county government offices. So this road apparently in Meona in Ito Mount Kenya Road. So I guess it leads to the slopes of Mount Kenya. So when you are going camping, maybe this is the road you use to get to the slopes of Mount Kenya. So you can still see it behind me. So the far I'm going to town, the far it's 
I'm going away from it. I wish it was on the other side, like I uh, was going near it. But it is what it is, so. Then you need to. We have to press that and enjoy that. I hope you can see that yellow cap over there. Oh my god, there it is. So, kuna kanini hapo kameandikwa na nyuki war cemetery. I don't know. But I hope. and then there's like a bridge and then there's a small river up and Karibuna sportsman um, hotel there you can see no sportsman Niko Karibuna town so near the town today we are not going to the mall we're just going straight home I don't think there's much I want to do here so I decided to go into a supermarket to get some snacks that I can go munching on my way back to Nairobi because I was doing not doing a lot in town. I didn't have a lot and then I was tired because I had woken quite early. So I just wanted to get some water, maybe a soda and uh, some biscuits. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was doing over here in the supermarket. Few snacks. Now going home. Ah, uh, I got another view from the town when I'm just leaving the town. Look, I was so crazy about this thing. I think the bad people in the Matatu are wondering what is wrong with this girl. She's never seen the mountain, but you guys, you can see from here, you can see it a, a bit clearer. You can see the the snow. If you can see, sorry for the camera, it's up and down. And uh, here yeah, I was just going home. I had had uh, an amazing day. It was awesome. It was amazing. I enjoyed my little stay in Nanyuki. Here we stopped and Narumoro, another view of the mountain. Oh my God. It was showing off that it was showing off that it was so beautiful i enjoyed my stay then on sunday i went to celebrate my birthday with my friends as i told you earlier so i had fun i enjoyed so much